How you guys doing out there? You guys feeling okay? Um, I just wanted to talk to you, the young brothers from, uh, I wanted to talk to you guys for a minute, especially young guys, man. And this ain't no, no, I'm a, and, and you know what? I'm going to go with this one. I'm going to say young black males. It ain't no race thing, but strictly, strictly, because a line of work that I do sometimes, I know. I had good friends of mine, good friends of mine, that was, that I won't say white, but was of the Caucasian race, told me, man, like a couple times, they got, um, one, one, he was telling me one story where he had heck of drugs on him. He had put over, and and when he, basically the officer, like a, a long story short, the officer seen it. But instead of him going farther to find it, because he knew if he had it in his pocket, it was probably more in a car. But he didn't even search him, and he kind of gave him a little wink, a little wink, like, you know. Same situation. That's why I'm going to really speak on young African-American males. Especially African-American males. And I'm not going to say African because the thing about Africans, the people of authority, and I'm not talking about businessmen. I'm just talking about like officers. The ones of authority, they don't be hating too hard on the Africans, but the African American, they be hating. Now I'm gonna show you a video right now. Or please, guys, whatever you need to do to use your mind to stay out of that jail cell, stay out because now I don't know how it is in a lot of places because this, I think this is like um, I think this takes place in the South. I'm not for sure. I don't know if this is Northern, but. This video right here just lets you guys know, man. You guys got to be cool, man. You guys got to be cool. And, and I'm about to show you why. I'm about to show you why. You guys got to be cool, man. Because this is scary. This is some scary stuff. I swear to God. Whitehead, what are you doing, man? What did I do? Man? I ain't never had a problem. Why are you going to spit on us? What so I just come around, you know how this is. Just take, head, the I just take the shit, bro. I swear to God, bro. Just take the fucking chains down. I just need to take the shit. That's all bro, she was going to do. That's all I need. Bro, you know, I don't give y'all problems like that, bro. I do not give you problems like that, short, bro. I'm a... <laughs> all you had to do was take the strings down, dude. I'll take them down next time, bro. Y'all ain't having no problem with me. I swear to God, bro, you know second shift, bro. You know, I be, I try my hard. Keep your leg down. Keep your leg down. I, I try my hard. Bro. You feel me? Because y'all y'all, y'all treat us right. You feel me? On everything. I give y'all double trace it's every right. day and everything. This ain't right right here, though. On my mom. You need medical? It's ain't. Like, nah, bro, I'm straight. I don't want no medical. You want decon out your I, ass? I need to get out my ass, though. I'm sure. Hey, no. Hey, look at he hitting the thing and stuff. Like, like he handcuffed. First of all, you all mad? Why you want to run up on him? First of all, he hitting the doors and stuff. Just so, so much hate. Like this dude didn't even do nothing to you. You smashing the doors and stuff in. You know what I'm saying? Why his hands tied down? Why you didn't pull him in there? Nobody in there. Say, hey, look, man, what's up? You know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody here. I ain't going to tell nobody, me and you, one-on-one, -on -one, what is, you know, why he can fight back. And nobody can see it. And whoever, man to man. How you going to pull him in there? He tied up. You got three of your dudes with you, and you acting all tough. You got three dudes and his hands tied. God, that kind of, them kind of guys, y'all know what used to happen to them in high school when it was just, yeah, yeah. But anyway, but um, that right there makes you really think. And there's nothing he can do. And the thing about it, by his being on camera, that lets you know that they know they're getting away with it. And once you own, once you private property. 
once you are private property in a number, they can do that because you, they property now. Damn, guys. That's scary. That's scared. Man, I know that dude. Probably on the street. If it was just him and that other dude on the street, I bet it wouldn't have went like that. He was in regular clothes. Like, they ran into each other in the parking lot. He was in regular clothes. The other dude was in regular clothes, and they just got into it. I bet it wouldn't went down like that. I bet. Even if the other dude won, I bet it when it went down like that. But uh, that's messed up, man. And all I'm saying is, uh, I made it out by the hairs of my chinny chin chin out of the system. Like, like I know my mom and grandmama and whoever I was dating at the time was praying so hard for me. And that's why uh, I'm not in there because I know a, a, a lot of my friends that I knew that was just like me. Some was way smarter than me in school in there. And I don't know if they're going through that because I don't know. Uh, I got to look again because I don't know what uh, area or what city or what part of town that is. But it's just a simple fact is, like I said, once you become private property, once you become somebody's property, and it's a private property, and it's private, where they own it, the state don't have nothing to do with it, it's private property, private stock, <clears throat> they can get away with that stuff, though. And if you got a guy in there that just probably get off his shift, he probably don't get no pussy. You know what I mean? He probably mad because probably his wife probably looking at TV, looking at something, probably looking at a dude like that. You know what I mean? I mean, it's a number of reasons, but he can see he just hate. He, dude, they ain't did nothing to that dude. Ain't did nothing to them. And like I said, and they cowards because silver fact is, if you'll do that, do it by yourself with his hands. Oh, why you coming? Why you need three people? Why his hands tied? Then you acting all. Then you see how he was in, like he's so tough. You hitting a dude with his hands tied, dog. With three of your friends right there, how you tough, man? God, really, that shit makes me so mad. Dang, man, you guys better be careful, man. Seriously, man, be careful, guys. Fuck. Oh.